Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. So I'm back again for another unboxing and review. And this time, alam ko guys, may just na kayo mag-unbox ako ng mga flagship smartphone. But hopefully this would be the last flagship na smartphone na i-unbox ko sa aking channel at least for this month. Since kakarating lang kasi ng ating smartphone nito and I've been waiting for this phone na dumating sa aking kamay at may experience siya. So without any further talking, let's go ahead and unbox the... Realme X50 Pro And dahil dyan guys, sa sobrang excited ko na dumating at ma-unbox ang ating Realme X50 Pro. Hindi na ako nakapaghintay pa at na-unbox ko na siya at nasarap. And this is the Realme X50 Pro. Iset aside ko lang muna ito guys. At least for the sake of unboxing experience, let me just show you and unbox ko ano bang meron sa loob ng ating Realme X50 Pro. So inside the box, babungan sa inyo yung maliit na box guys. So inside this small box, we have the user guide manual and the warranty card and as a Chinese character. And we also have the free jelly case for the Realme X50 Pro. So inside the box, as you can see, wala na yung Realme X50 Pro na unit since na unbox at na setup ko na siya. So sa pinakaloob ng ating Realme X50 Pro na box, we have the wall charger which is the super dark na wall charger, USB type A to USB type C cable, and the SIM pin ejector. At ito na ang ating Realme X50 Pro 5G. And as you can see guys, I have the moss green color for the Realme X50 Pro. And actually, noong una ko palang talaga siya nakita nung launch pa lang ng Realme X50 Pro sa India. Sobrang gandang-ganda talaga ako sa color na ito guys. And especially nung nakita ko talaga siya in person, sobrang ganda niya. And as you can see, may matte finish tayo sa likod ng ating Realme X50 Pro. So mas less yung smudges niya sa ating likod guys. But hindi talaga ako makaget over sa color ng ating Realme X50 guys. Sobrang ganda ng color niya. I'm not sure kung nakikita niya siya clearly but sobrang ganda ng pagka-green sa ating Realme X50 Pro. And I think of all the green smartphone na nilabas sa market today, I think by far this is my personal favorite na color green sa isang smartphone. Sobrang ganda niya guys. And also very premium yung feels niya sa kamay ko. At medyo may kabigatan siya. So it really shows or feels talaga na parang sobrang premium talaga ng materials at quality ng ginamit sa ating Realme X50 Pro. And by the way, yung likod natin is gawa sa glass and also yung sa harap ng ating ating Realme X50 Pro and protected na rin siya ng Corning Gorilla Glass 5 while yung frame naman niya is gawa sa aluminum. And before tayo guys at ipakita ko sa inyo ang ating display, itour ko lang kayo guys kung ano bang meron sa labas ng ating Realme X50 Pro. So sa right part ng ating phone, we have the power button na may gold accent sa kanyang button. Sa left part naman guys, we have the volume rocker. On the upper part of the phone, we have the secondary microphone. And sa lower naman ng ating phone, we have the speaker grill, USB Type-C port, microphone, and the SIM tray. I'm not sure kung napapansin nyo guys, but I think this is by far the smallest dual punch hole camera na nakita ko sa isang display. And this one has a 6.44 inch Super AMOLED display with 1080p resolution, 409 ppi density, HDR10+, Plus. and what's good thing about the Realme X50 Pro, and just like the other flagship na nilabas ngayon 2020, this one has a 90Hz refresh rate kasi sobrang battery smooth at ang bilis ng ating Realme X50 Pro. And also aside from that, we also have a 20 by 9 aspect ratio 
para sa ating Realme X50 Pro. I'm currently running the Antutu Benchmark app para sa ating Realme X50 Pro para malaman natin talaga kung gaano nga baka powerful ang ating smartphone. And this phone runs in Realme UI 1.0 based on Android 10 and power na rin siya ng pinaka-latest at flagship chipset sa market today which is the Qualcomm Snapdragon 865 with GPU of Adreno 650. And again guys, yung variant na meron ako right now for the Realme X50 Pro is the 8GB of RAM and 256GB of internal storage. nakikita nyo ngayon guys, we got a 559,107 ang Tutu Benchmark Score para sa ating Realme X50 Pro 5G. So overall, very capable talaga ang phone for multitasking, multimedia and social media consumption, and also heavy games like PUBG, Call of Duty, and Asphalt 9. And if you're gonna ask me kung umiinit nga ba ang ating Realme X50 Pro 5G, yes, umiinit siya guys, but hindi naman siya ganun ka-alarming na init. And also, for a while, nagsasubside rin naman yung init sa ating smartphone. And this phone has a 4,200 mAh battery capacity and capable na siya ng 65 watts fast charging guys. So in 35 or less than 35 minutes, you'll get 100% battery capacity para sa ating Realme X50 Pro. We got a dual punch hole camera design para sa ating Realme X50 Pro 5G with a 32 megapixel with f2.5 aperture wide camera, an 8 megapixel with f2.2 aperture ultra wide, and for video recording guys, and I think okay na okay siya for video or for vlogging, since this one can actually shoot up to 1080p resolution at 30 frames per second, at meron na rin siyang electronic image stabilization para sa ating selfie or front camera. For rear naman guys, as you can see, we got a quadruple camera setup for the Realme X50 Pro 5G with a 64 megapixel with f1.8 aperture wide camera, a 12 megapixel with f2.5 aperture telephoto lens, an 8 megapixel with f2.3 aperture ultra wide, and a 2 megapixel with f2.4 aperture depth sensor. For video recording, yung rear natin can actually shoot up to 4K resolution at 60 frame per second and also good na rin siya for video or vlogging since this one has an electronic image stabilization para sa ating rear camera. looking for a versatile phone na pwedeng from vlogging, from photography, then this is something na pwede kong may recommend sa inyo guys. Not only that we have a 6 camera para sa ating Realme X50 Pro, I really like the dynamic range para sa ating phone and also yung consistency ng colors from an ultra wide shot to a wide shot. Sobrang detail pa ng mga photos guys and I really like the colors, very accurate ng colors na nakunan natin using the Realme X50 Pro. And one thing na nagustuhan ko talaga guys is yung macro shot or yung macro lens para sa ating Realme X50 Pro. hindi pa talaga available ang ating Realme X50 Pro 5G sa ating bansa but I really do hope that Realme Philippines should bring this phone sa Philippine market and for sure maraming tatangkilik at bibili ng ating Realme X50 Pro 5G at kung kating-kating na talaga kayo makabili guys ng ating Realme X50 Pro 5G then I'll be putting the link ng Shondi Philippines sa description box para makapag-inquire kayo sa kanila for the availability of this product 
So kung nagustuhan nyo ang unboxing and review ko for the Realme X50 Pro, please don't forget to like this video guys, share it to your social media account, and don't forget to subscribe to my channel and tap the bell icon para ma-notify kayo sa mga future unboxing video ko. So once again, this is Wax from Wax Attack channel. Have a great day guys. Bye guys.